Hello, fluffy people of the world. Welcome back to Life is Strange 2. Uh, now, it's been a few days since I last recorded, so hopefully I haven't forgotten everything. Um, the last thing that happened was Daniel exploded, and we have no idea my hair is in fucking knots. Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah, so he exploded, and we don't know who's dead, who's alive. Sean has a shard of glass in his eye. Uh... I couldn't tell by the preview if we're playing as Daniel or we're still Sean. I, uh, Cassidy could be dead. Uh, I mean, f uh, seriously. And it looks like we may have jumped several years into the future here, so I'm interested to start. By the way, I've just like come out of the shower, so my hair is still damp. Um, so I apologize for the visage, but let's just uh, get stuck in. This is gonna be one hell of a story time intro this time. In a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They lived in peace until hunters took their dad away. <coughs> and they had to go on the run. Mm. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. They discovered a secret hideout. A super villain. They train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick, and they had to move on. The brothers made it to the home of their ancestors, and the old wolves took care of them. Unfortunately, the hunters were hot on their trail and found them. If it turns out that Daniel killed Cassidy, the brothers had nowhere I'm, to stay. I'm emotionally so done with this game. To keep going south. <laughs> they soon Cassidy the better not be dead. Where they met a pack of stray dogs who worked in a secret farm. The brothers joined them and worked hard to stock up on gold. For the gold. Future. Drug money. To find others like them. And everybody loved the little wolf. Who was growing up fast. Oh. He was becoming a bit of a little His shit. His power was growing too. <laughs> the little wolf was more and more confident. And independent. Yes, he was. And he's still nine years old. The big brother hooked up with a cool she-dog. <laughs> she dog. They had their own adventures. They had sex, is what they had. Suddenly, the mean farmers who owned the land tried to hurt the brothers. The little cub was injured. He transformed into a super wolf and destroyed everything. Mm. The big brother was badly wounded. Shot of glass in the eyes. He didn't know where the little cub was. Yeah, that much was clear by the ending. Da Daniel wasn't there, so I'm guessing he ran away in shame or... or something. Life is Strange 2 is a story-based game that highlights player choice. Your actions and decisions will have consequences and impact the world around you and your brother. Will it? Am I still with my brother then? Or is that just a copy-paste fucking loading screen? It's a million degrees, by the way. I'm in the middle of a heat wave, so I'm boiling. I've got my I've got my old school fan, <laughs> like a fucking like a posh person. We're back in the. This looks like very very similar to the first episode. Just straight up on the run in the woods. We've got short. We've got hair again. Oh, is this a? Hang on. Is this a flashback? He looks younger, plus he's got his hair back. Yeah. Dream? Hey, Sean. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. It was a bad idea. Daniel. No way. It's all good. Have we had this conversation before? 
when he tried to stop me from going with Finn. Oh, right, okay. I was too pissed. It's okay, dude. You're my brother. And that's all that counts. So, why don't hmm. you come and get me? Or? What do you mean, come and get you? Now, I'm guessing this is some sort of dream, uh, conscience fucking dream sort of a thing. I don't know what to do. I'm scared. Don't well, get don't so close to that edge. Don't stand near the edge. That's a Please, good start. Come and get me. Yes. Where are you? I swear. I need something to go on, man. Why'd you run away? Uh, stop. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Shaved head. Oh, they shaved my cool hairstyle. Unless this is like three years later. Hospital in Northern California. Two months after the blast at Merrill's. We're in a hospital. I mean, do they know our identity? Are we about to bust Fuck. out of the hospital? This left of us. Punishment. Are we about to? I wonder. I'm guessing the cops are about to get involved. Oh, I can't even focus on the page. Uh, this sucks ass, man. This sucks ass. Da -da -da -da, was in a coma for weeks, blind and fucked, in police custody. Oh, right. Okay. So, yeah, the police know where we are. And we were in a coma. Um, going to jail. So, hospital freaks me out. Hate, hate this. Where's Daniel? I'm scared. They could write it in a more legible way. <laughs> Try to draw to kill time. This room is like a cage, but I suck now. No depth perception, no art, no shit. Focusing equals immediate migraine. Even with a good eye? Woke up crying. That's not good. Special secret agent Flores. Special secret agent. She's trying to bond with me, trap me or trust me. So fucked. Cops still can't find Daniel after the explosion. Hmm. Happy birthday, Daniel, wherever you are, Enano. Somebody pointed out that Enano means, um, uh, like, little one or midget or something like that. Uh, Claire and Steven sent me a nice letter. So lonely, I read it twice. Weird how I missed them. So cool to hear from Captain Spirit too. Glad he's doing fine there. Yeah, that is good. Yeah, good, good, good. I thought we left him sort of deep in the shit. My Joey sketch doesn't look bad. So glad he's around. Who's Joey? Da -da 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 -da. Wish I could hear Cass play again. All those songs are gone, but not our time together. Is she alive? Is she dead? I fucked Daniel up, I let Finn become his brother. Well, that's not your fault, dude. Can we see his eye? Oh, it's covered. Okay, I need to know if Cassidy's a le Cassidy's letter! Oh! I miss Cass so much. Wish I could hold her. Ah, so I've got to read this. Skip all of this boring shit if you want to, but I need to read this shit. So she's alive. Howdy city boy. Uh, I can just read it normally. Fuck that. Uh, yeah, I'll read it. I'll read it like a human on the actual letter. Howdy, city boy. Bet you're surprised to hear from me. I round... No. 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 I found out we were in the same hospital from the police after we were questioned when I was checked out a month ago. So, I took the chance to write and hope, hope you get this. Wish I could say everything I want, but you never know who's reading... If anybody else is reading this, fuck you. <laughs> I truly hope you are okay after what happened. As for me, I don't remember much except the explosion at Meryl's office. Then I woke up in the hospital with blunt trauma. Uh, so she doesn't remember much blunt trauma, what the doctors call blast lung injury. Just glad that I can still play guitar and sing. Not that I feel like it. You learn a, sh you learn a shitload about medicine stuck in a hospital bed. As I'm sure you know, my sweet compadre is still working on that Espanol. <laughs> Miss my lessons and my teacher. You probably know more about what's going on than me, but Hannah, Penny, and I were released without charges. Good. Uh, Finn. I'm guessing Finn's dead because one of the one of the outcomes of uh, of the last episode was Finn could die, and in these sorts of games, when a character can die. In one, when a character can die or survive in one moment, they typically always end up dead anyway. Um, 
the Walking Dead games are a textbook example of that. Um, there's never any real choice. I, I, somebody who can die always ends up dead anyway. Anyway, you probably... The police were stoked to bust a farm of drug traffickers rather than us gutter punks toiling in the field. We asked about you and Daniel but got no answers. So with Finn and you gone... Yeah, Finn's dead. Or maybe he's gone. With Finn and you gone, our rail family's kind of broken up now. Now we're just a lonely trio, train hopping up and down the state. But it feels like we're going in a loop to nowhere. Hannah and Penny aren't the same and we fight too much. I'm not even sure we'll be together for much longer. Shit changes, right? Maybe I'll have a whole new set of blues songs for the road. I hope we see Cassidy again. I know you're going to trial soon over the Seattle situation and you will get the justice and freedom you deserve. You and Daniel are amazing brothers and I hope you find your way home soon. I hope we can swim naked again under a new moonlight. So do I. It's a big world and maybe we'll meet again someday. I'll always be singing your song, Love and Peace, Cassidy. So that's good. She's not in trouble. She's completely fine. We've got her tattoo. Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. And we can wear an eye patch now. That's just the coolest thing ever. I mean, it's bad that he's lost an eye, but come on, dude. It's cool. Can't catch shit. <sighs> Zero depth perception. You know, I've tried, like... Nice sports. I've actually tried, like, clo like covering our closing one eye and doing stuff. And it's not... Depth perception isn't that fucked. You know what I mean? They always say if you lose an eye, you you literally have like fuck all depth perception, but you you do this just close like just just literally close one eye, and I can still gauge distances pretty fucking well. So I don't know. Weird. Aren't yeah. Floris's? Thanks for the card, Agent. U.S. Department yeah, of Justice, FBI. Text. Federal Bureau of Investigation, Maria Elena Flores, Special Agent. Uh, okay, call in time, day or night. Okay. Okay. Call Joey. Oh, is he the, like, the... Yeah. Um, Stupid reality shows. Physical uh, help. I don't know what the f My brain's farting right now. The physical fucking therapy. PT. Therapist. Let's call Joey. My eye is hurting. It's a shame that he's lost, he's lost that haircut, though. Is he uh, is he incoming? Oh, draw draw real quick before Joey comes. I didn't see that was an option. I wonder how shit this is going to be. Oh, uh, look at the vision. I was wondering before I started this episode if your vision, first person, was going to change and you have like a blacked out side of the screen, and it is because he's got one eye. That's great. Oh, attention to detail. Draw. Is this going to look like absolute shit? It looks pretty fine to me. So hard to focus. Gotta practice way more. Not giving up. So hard to focus, I mean... I guess that's an okay start. Is his other eye sort of fucked as well, then? Or does it just mean his sort of artistic focus? That looks pretty good to me, man. He's still got the penmanship. Draw prison bars. Draw a staircase. Staircase to heaven. Uh... Cause we going up, motherfucker. We're not we're not getting trapped. That's cool. That's really cool. Wish I could find a highway to freedom. This is like his best drawing yet. I find a highway to freedom. Achievement unlocked uh Kira Skuro. You you can't see that, but it pops up on my screen. Kira Skuro. That's the uh the study of light and dark, isn't it? Joey! 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 What up, dude? <laughs> Good day, sunshine. Hey, Joey. How's it going? Hey, man. That looks like it might have been food. Hard to tell. Hospital food isn't uh -huh. that bad. Never heard that before. Oh, 
Somebody is in a bad mood. Sorry, Joey. Not feeling it today. Mm. I don't blame you. Don't blame but Joey. Maybe I got something to cheer you up. Pecans and chocolate? Uh-oh. There's that smile. He is... I suppose he is like um, a prisoner. Any headaches? Okay. Socket pain? No. It's all good. Well, this is your final test before... Mm, you know. Before I get sent well, down? Check you out. Check I'm, out. Did you I'm gonna escape. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's see. You know the drill. Don't blink and just stare at the light. Oh, is this gonna be first person? Yes. Nice retina response. Okay. Oh, now, so his other his try to follow the light. So his works. other eye is kind of fucked as well. Follow the light. Okay. Good. Good. Oh, I've got professional tracking skills. Quick response. Nice. I'm a fucking pro, dude. Sean, you got this. Remember to see objects on your left side. You got to turn your head more now. Yes. I've got Looking the skills. Good, hmm. Now try to align your pen with mine. I'll try. Oh, right. I'll okay. Rush. Depth perception. This is hold, tough. Hold right click to lock your view and... and. This is tough. What the fuck? When locked, uh, press left click to try. See if your pen is aligned. It's further than that. Come on. Keep going. Oh, no, it's not. Your depth perception will always be affected, so you gotta try harder. Oh, shit. That's not that far, it's like that. Yeah, I know. It's hard. Oh, come on. Fuck off, man. Yeah, that's <laughs> No steam achievement for me. But remember... Fuck's sake. Your depth perception will always be affected. Hmm. Here, read this. Patient cleared. Uh, get me out of here. He's not going to fucking help me. And I don't want to put that on him either. Do you know what I mean? He's just a, an innocent sort of physical therapist sort of guy. Um, I'm a pirate. Patient cleared. I don't know what these mean. What, what form is this? Let's put I'm a pirate because it sounds cool. But I don't, I don't know what we're doing here. Out of patch. Arr. I'd be more worried if you weren't such a smart ass. Mm -hmm. You can try, but you can't rig the exam, Sean. <sighs> it's time we release you. Sorry. Your vision has improved a lot. Now you don't really have severe side effects anymore. Yeah. That's just great. I do have to tell them the truth. But first, let's clean this dress. Hey, what? sure hope you're watching the door like your phone. Oh, come Ooh. on. Flora's going nowhere. Great. All I do is watch him. Yes, true. Your job. Hello? Do you mind if we talk alone? Mind special, special agent? My patient? He looks good for now, right? Just come back when I'm finished with him. Well, she's a bit bossy, isn't she? Sure. So what do the police think happened in the drug place Swing then? Later, Sean. Explosion? Stay cool. Catch you later, Joey. Have a good one. Now you. Oh, Daniel, uh, Sean's not looking happy. Is she on my side? Like, so, I don't get this. How are you feeling today, Mr. Diaz? Amazing. Did you find Daniel? I want to go over this again. <sighs> what? I've been telling the same fucking story for three weeks. How much longer? Until it makes sense. Until you get it right. So, silence isn't gonna help you now. Hey. Listen close, Sean. Tomorrow you're going to Jolina Shore and you'll be arraigned in court. Mm. For the murder of a Seattle police officer. Where's the fucking you evidence? Spend the rest of your life in prison. This, Listen, talk to me. This makes no sense. Please tell me this isn't time. Can I just pause it? This makes no sense. I'm sorry, but this doesn't make any sense. How did the police officer die? Like, there's no there's no gunshot wound, no knife wound. The the police 
via cam via car camera shows him just sort of like vaguely flying it. There's, there's no actual physical evidence that anyone murdered anyone. This, no, this doesn't make any sense, man. Um. I didn't. I'm, I'm. Honesty is the best policy. I would tell them of Daniel's fucking power. I didn't kill anyone. The end. So, who did? You do know. It's just. I can't. Was Daniel involved? Is that why you can't talk? No, no way. And you're absolutely sure your dad didn't go after the officer? Are you. Yeah, are you kidding me? Are you shitting me? That officer freaked out and shot him! In front of me and Daniel! Just guilty of being... Who knows? I hear you, but... You're sure you didn't get upset and go after the officer? It what happens. The fuck? Jesus, no! Look at me! Okay, let's just jump ahead. She doesn't believe us. Tell me what happened in that farm in Humboldt. Oh. The place looks like a tornado wiped it out. I've told you so many times. I have no clue why the place was trashed. Gas explosion? I passed out. Plus three seriously wounded, along with you. And a missing child. Nobody's statement matches with each other. Sean, throw me a bone here. Can't you see I want to help? So you uh, haven't found uh, her. Uh, I think you want to further you your like career. You can help by telling me the truth. <sighs> okay. Um, Fuck. I'm... The robbery. Whose idea was it? It was Chase? fucking Finn's idea. Or yours. Huh? Uh, honesty? It, how many times am I going to say that phrase uh, in, in this <laughs> fucking game? Honesty is the best policy. It was Finn's idea, and I was completely against it. Finn. It was his idea to rip off Mero. Did he force you to help? Or did you go along with it? Neither. Neither. I went to get Daniel back. He lied. I went along. He lied. I mean, did he lie? I'm gonna say... Did he lie? He lied. I didn't want to help. But he got Daniel involved. Oh, he's I alive. Swear. Hang on. Swear. I didn't think anything like this was going to happen. Nobody does, Sean. Oh. Until it's too late. Yeah. Now I know. And what about Cassidy? She planned all this with Finn? Nope. No, she was against it. She was on my side. She was against this stupid plan. She had nothing to do with it. Your friends are learning the hard way. Your friends are learning the hard way. They didn't deserve it? They didn't deserve it. We all make mistakes. Yeah. Well, some mistakes are worse than others. By the way, we contacted your grandparents in Beaver Creek. They Steven... can visit you after you're transferred. Might be a while. There's no way. You do have a support group. There's no way we're going to jail. I couldn't track down your mother, though. Sorry. Good. What about Daniel? You said you had leads. I said might. Oh, she's so cryptic. Uh, hold on. I gotta take this call. I think she's largely full of shit. Sorry. There's no way we're going to prison. We're, we're gonna bust out of this motherfucker. Right, she's left the pictures behind. Hang on, that's it. That's the only thing I can click on. Yes. Sorry, Finn. So is he... That's a hospital gun, so he survived. Daniel into this shit. I, th I think he survived. Because I thought he was dead, and then our one of our dialogue choices was he lied to the police, etc. So I think Finn survived. About, you know, maybe saying that Sean was involved and shit. She didn't want anything to do with this. She's got a black eye. At least that's the worst she got. But it, but we read the letter. She's free and clear. No, no, no. All charges dropped. Wonder what Meryl told the cops about the robbery. Mm. Sorry, Hannah. She lost her family for this. 
What does that mean? She lost her family for this. She was, she was, she was living life on the lam like we were. Family nowhere to be seen. Oh, right. It, right no, no, she. They mean that the the train folk, Finn, and all that shit. Well, Finn was a dick anyway. Hope the cops didn't mess with Penny. Mm. Prison would fuck him up. Prison would fuck Sorry anyone up. Okay. So what's Come going on, on with Dan? Sean, stop being so pissy. Yes, we do. That's our job. The Bureau put his profile out over four states. So we are on the case. Is it a good thing that we're trying to find, that the law is trying to find Daniel? Isn't that kind of what we were trying to avoid? For how long? It's been over two months. How are you going to find him? We have a lot of people looking for your brother. Trust me. We want to find him too. Yeah, yeah. So you can lock him up too, right? Whatever. Anyway. Thanks for talking to me. She just wants to further her I'll career. I'll be back tomorrow to take you to Jolina Shore. Thanks. Thanks for the words of wisdom and, you know, guidance and comfort. What a, what a shitty situation. Can you imagine being in this situation? Just nobody believing you. Everybody thinking you killed a police officer that you didn't kill. Just, what the fuck would you do? What could you do? Look out. I have to guard the guard now. At least I've got Joey. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Sit down so we can get this show going. What show going? Physical so, shit? Test? Exam? How did your interview with Scully go? You mean interrogation? Who knows? Maybe Detective Flores wants to help. Maybe it did, not. It didn't feel that way. After what you and your brother went through, I don't blame you. Oh, this shit is all wrong, man. You've been out of the garden for three weeks now. We talk every day. I can see that you're a good person. Thank you. Thank you. That's that. Yes, yes. Thanks, Joey. Want to tell that to the judges? I'm just saying, you don't deserve this. Now let's check this out. So is he... Yeah, is, is the eye gone? The is coming along nice. Just got to keep it clean for the next week or so. Simple. That's great. Seen the shrink this morning? What did she say? Nothing I want to hear. This will take time and rehab, Sean. You have to process first. Ugh. I could tell myself that shit. Clearly, I'm no therapist, but I've nursed patients with your injury. They all turned their anger into energy. You will too. Has he lost the eye or not? Plus, the glass eye tech is pretty cool uh, now. <laughs> Things change, huh? I would go with a, a fucking eye patch any day. Because <laughs> it looks cool. I hear you. I'm trying to be positive. But Must be so hard. Yeah. I know. I do. But I promise there's a treat coming your way. A treat. Now as for your wound, this is the last time you hear this from me. You have to clean it with sterile gauze and saline solution. Gauze and saline solution. Gauze and saline. I guess we're gonna have to do that on the run when we run away from this hospital. And cream. So use the saline solution on the on the thing, and then on the on the eye. Wrap it up with clean dressing. This is so the Your instruction shirt. manual. Remember, you yeah. have to do this. Yes. Four times a day. Jesus Christ! Again. Four times. I'm sorry about everything, Sean. Wish I could have done more. Dude, you saved my ass here. You're the only one I trust. It really helped. Cool. I'm glad when I can make a ch- oh. oh, shit. Shit's hitting the fan. Emergency. I'm out. And no mm -hmm. smoke break. Let's say our goodbye tomorrow. Oh, Sean, check out that towel. Got your name all over it. What? Catch you later. 
See you on the flippity flip. W what's that about a towel? <sighs> Joey. You are. Joey's the Here's only a boss. one who helped me get through this shit. Hmm. Oh, hang on. Other letters. Uh, I don't. Kitten's leg is better. We, oh, this is from the grandparents. We are grateful to find out that you're safe and awake. The police contacted us when you were found unconscious. We weren't allowed to visit you in the hospital, but we want you to recover ASAP. The doctor said that you woke up from the coma stronger than before. The most important thing now is to find Daniel. We are helping the police any way we can. They really want to help find him too, Sean. Hopefully this reflects well during your trial. We must know this... We know this must be hard for you after everything you and your brother have been through. You're both in our thoughts and prayers every night. We hope to visit you in Jolina Shore. Is that a made-up place? Chris insisted to write a little note. It's attached to this letter. He doesn't know Daniel is missing. Don't know. Oh my God! To come back, Chris. <laughs> Nice, that little this, this is from Captain Spirit. Hi, Sean and Daniel. Hope you're okay. I am fine, but I miss both of you a lot. When are you coming back? Dad has been better lately, so he stopped beating him. He says hello, and we are fishing now that summer is here. We do a lot of stuff outside. All the snow is gone. You should come back to see Beaver Creek without the snow. Okay, are, th are we going to see some of his, like, shit drawings? My art is trash now. It was good. What I drew of the window looked good. Oh, pick up the pen. I don't know what we can do with that, but I'll take it. A cheap and unlocked, a new perspective, souvenir, I see. Um. Oh, we don't have our backpack. Yay. Stupid reality shows. <laughs> you know, fun fact, I never watch TV, ever. I don't have a, a TV in my... I've got one in my house, but um, not in my room. And I never, ever watch it. I'm on the computer all hours of the day. Fuck TV. So it sounds like... Ooh, I saw a little bit of an empty socket. Oh, fuck the glass eye, though. Seriously, eye patch for the win. Um, and it sounds like, yes, the other eye is damaged as well. So that's a bit of shit. Hmm. Instructions for getting out of here. Oh. You know, it would have sucked if you lost both eyes. Can you imagine? Right, so we're here. The way out is hang a right all the way down. And that's it. Hang, hang a right and then take the stairs. Uh... <laughs> Electrical switchboard. Are we going to have to actually use any of that information? They kept me locked in for two months. Two months? Except for a daily exercise break. Two months? You're here just for me. Oh. I'm flattered. I wonder if... Well, clearly, this is where we escape. <laughs> so... Salvation lies ahead. Is it a good idea? That, I mean, I, I've been saying since the beginning, why are we running? We should have just stayed there on the lawn from day one. But, I mean... Damn. Do we go on the run? Yeah. Thanks for the seen, car, agent. Seen this already. Bouncing ball. I can't catch. Yeah, 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 yeah. Zero depth perception. Has he given us something inside the towel? I'm so what? warm. I'm, I'm sweating. Wow. I haven't seen you in a long time. Is that a sketchbook? I wonder where Lila went in all of this. Can we call Lila? I'm guessing as a prisoner, I don't get access to our phone. I know I fucked Daniel over. Again. How? We've now done nothing. Over. We've done nothing but try and be Real good and help him. A ten-year-old by himself? F go to Not find... There. He's going to find his mother. Clearly, come on. Back to Seattle. But too far. Didn't we see the address of the mother? 
Daniel was the one who wanted to go find Mom. They would have definitely told me. Or the cops. I can't remember if we actually saw the address of the mother or not. It's obvious he's going to find his mama. What's that? Super wolf. Huh? Uh, okay, that's less that read. It means that Daniel... Let's read. Daniel's with Jacob somewhere? Hang on, hang on. Stop. He's stop. safe? Shut up. Stop talking. I can see him again. Huh. Had a few beers. Uh, hang on. 23rd of Feb 2017. I've, I haven't been following the dates, but I think that's very, very recently. Had a few beers. Daniel's asleep. Oh, this is Sean's writing. Same night every night. He wants to train more, but we don't have time. And it's not that easy. Sean, this is the blue letters i'm guessing i borrowed a blanket and a few other things from your tent we'll give them back to you when you come looking for your super wolf comic it's waiting for you jake now i'm sorry but who's jake hang on let's go all i gotta do is find that page with jacob's home who the fuck is jacob I'm sorry, I'm drawing a blank. I should know. Um, Meryl, the owner, Jacob. I don't remember Jacob in the in the um, tent area. Do you know what I mean? The the, the train folk. I don't remember a Jacob. Haven Point, Nevada. Oh, hang on. Is ah Jacob? He was this sort of weirdo who was a bit um, like I didn't trust him. That I, I remember now. Met the new workers from Europe. Anders and Ingrid uh, had a long talk with Jacob. He's, a, he's like a little kid. He's lived in some religious commune from Haven Point, Nevada. Looks fine here. Free. That's it, right? I wanted to go forward, but I can't. Okay. I gotta get to him. That's odd. I gotta find a way to escape tonight. Hmm. Okay. I'm a bit confused with how anyone has written a note in Sean's diary. And how does that... I'm, I'm stupid. <laughs> but I don't, I don't... After the explosion happened, everything went to shit, Daniel took off. How, how or why is anyone writing in Sean's little diary? Okay. Time to clear off now. This whole hospital is so quiet. All right, okay. So don't make any noise. I'm just going to re read real quick. Um, do I have access to the diary? I do. Um, right, so these are just pages from hanging out in the tent. Now, this is where I wanted to... This this is the, the blue note. Uh, Sean, I borrowed a blanket and a few other things from your tent. We'll give them back to you when you come looking for your Super Wolf comic. It's waiting for you, Jake. So how does he read that and get the idea that Daniel is with Jake? Drawing Cassidy the Wild versus Hannah the Wise. Okay. Oh, fucking hell. Um, I've read half of these already. Yep. Okay. Get the hell out of here. I'm a bit confused by that no. diary entry, but let's just roll with it. Let's roll with it. Yeah. Thanks for the card, Agent. Can't Joey could probably distract the guard dog. Uh okay, I'll keep that in mind. Maybe I could uh rig a decoy Sean in the bed. <laughs> okay. Fantastic. Rig a decoy so we're gonna make like a head shape. Uh Okay. Just open the window. Get some fresh air. Or is it locked? Because yeah. Need a superhero to open that shit. I'm, I'm guessing so. That's that's so we can't escape. Hope my last view of this world is in this window. Oh. Reception desk. Can I steal that car? I mean, are we just gonna add loads of real, actual crimes? I could climb down the side of the building. Hmm. Or die trying. One stupid car. And I'm okay. not here. 
Okay, so it looks like we're going to go. This is what I was worried about. This is why I didn't want to run in the first place. Because I knew we'd have to commit a bunch of real crimes. Um, let's rig the fake Sean in the bed. <laughs> I'm so fucking warm. Honest to God, I'm a million. Sorry if this is loud when What's I get the fan out. But it might work for a second. I'm so fucking hot. It's like 37 degrees in here. All right, so we've rigged the fake Sean. We can call Joey. Um, if we're going out the window, there must be a way to leave this room without alerting anyone. Uh, close the curtain. Is that going to be a problem, though? I, should, I wouldn't. I'd imagine a prisoner isn't allowed to close the curtain. Can I have some privacy, please? I don't know if that's allowed. Let's just leave that out. Oh, can I go behind it now? Let's just try opening the window. Can't open that window with my bare hands. Oh, it, it zoomed on the. It zoomed in on the mechanism. Uh, can I not, can I not do it like in the movies, use the car to slot the lock? Okay. Right, there's nothing else, is there? Oh. Calm down. Ooh, ooh, careful. What's up there? Nothing. Too bad this isn't a movie. Can't even well, fit. fuck me for trying. Anything else? I'm guessing I've just got to either call Joey or, uh, yeah. That says, call Joey or call Joey. Hang on, is there anything in the bathroom? Real quick. I wonder if, if I should. Oh, hello. Hello, hang on. Grab bar. Let's grab this one. Maybe. Yeah. That metal bar isn't going anywhere. What about this one? Is it loose? This one isn't screwed in. Oh. Ooh. That might be a bad idea. Let's do it. I've got my settings set to hold rather than tap because I don't want to wreck my mouse. Hey. What the hell are you doing in there? Taking a noisy shit, dude. Oh, that was probably a bad idea. Can I just re oh, can I reassure job, him? Sean. Now the guard is awake and pissed off. Okay. Well, I got uh, I got a bar. I wonder if I absolutely needed that. Let's close the curtain. Um, hang on. Can I just real one more time? It's out to the right. I just gotta get past that locked door. And an angry guard. Right, there's a locked door in the middle. I've seen it on the... It's halfway down the green line. That's a locked door, I'm guessing. Okay. I'd prefer to go out the window. Um, I might... Let's call Joey. Let's see what happens. This is probably a shit idea. But something is going to work, you know what I'm saying? Ambush God, oh shit. Um I'd rather No, because assaulting someone is far worse than breaking a window. No way. I just called Joey. Oh shit. Don't want them to find me stepping over that window. Oh fuck I'm not hitting him with the Oh my god, this has gone to absolute shit. Um <sighs> Wish I could just Walk out. Ambush guy. I really don't want to do that. I'm pretty sure the scaffolding leads into this room. Uh, oh, maybe I shouldn't have called Joey. Fuck. My backpack has got to be somewhere around here. Right, so we need to get on the scaffolding to get inside the room, and then I guess, I guess we're going to come out of there. I could trick him into coming in here, and then... I'm not doing that, do you? Knock him out? 
Surely there's got to be a better thing than physical assault. Surely. Or have I, like, fucked it now by calling Joey and break and waking him up? Oh, bollocks. I've gone and, I've gone and fucked the pooch here. Is Joey coming or not? Oh, shit, yeah. You got I didn't do anything. Patient called. Just gotta see what our boy needs. I'm not, uh, I'm not ambushing Joey, am I? Hey, that's your job. Go for it. Oh, fuck. Hey, there's my second favorite patient. <laughs> gotcha. You never stop working, Joey. I'm doing a double night shift. Diane is out with a flu, so lucky me. Yeah, I'm fried. But that sweet, sweet overtime. Sean, you look stressed. I'm planning a breakout, dude. I know where Daniel is, my head hurts. Just, this is this, no good can come from this one, but I'm still gonna get, tell the fucking truth. Yeah, I know where my brother is. What? How? I found a note in the sketchbook you brought me. He's in Nevada. With, um, a friend of ours. Fuck, Sean. That's awesome. Yes, That's it is. News. Now you've got to let me go. Sucks, but <laughs> at least the kid is safe. Does Nevada Listen, suck? Joey, I need to get out of here. What? Come on, Sean. You know I can't let you do it. It is a shit idea. You know I'm on your side, man. I don't blame you for being scared. You're leaving tomorrow. But don't fuck around with this. You hear me? I do hear you. I am scared. <laughs> Fucking saying you're innocent, it doesn't help at all. I'm scared. Joey, I'm scared. I'm so scared. I've never felt like this. Like, I'll be in jail for life, and I'll never see Daniel again. I can't do it, man. I hear you, man. I swear, that kills me to see you in that situation, Sean, but you really want me to help you break out of here? No. I just need to me. Yeah. I lose my job, go to jail. I have a girlfriend, a rent to pay, a future. Yeah, I'm sorry. I, I didn't think this would... I didn't think we were calling him in for this. I thought Joey might distract the guard or some shit. Like, without knowing, you know? Sorry. I'm sorry, Joey. I was... Joey's right. I was being selfish. I just... I want to help my brother. It's all I can think about. He's ten years old. And out there. All alone. He needs... His big brother. Okay. Apparently he's with Stop. Jacob. Fuck. <sighs> oh wow, is he gonna help us? I don't wanna get I don't wanna get to help you. Are you, you, you serious? I don't wanna get Joey in trouble. No. I'm stupid. <laughs> so let's do this right. Find something to hit me with. I already found a grab bar in the bathroom. I was gonna use it to escape. Somehow. You're not gonna hurt me that bad. Uh, it's I'll a fucking them. metal bar. Me from behind in the dark that I didn't see shit. They can't prove I let you get away. I hope. Oh my god, I don't wanna! Um... I'm not. I am... I'm sorry. Not even to escape. I'd rather just not escape. I'm not hitting Joey. Joey? I can't do that. I don't want to hurt you. Just forget it. Okay. I wish I could help you, Sean. I'm really sorry. I'm not dragging uh, him into this. I should go back to my shift. Yeah, that's that's the best thing to do. Just no questions. Just okay, cool. I'll see you later. Thanks for the help. I'm not fucking hitting Joey. He's the only cool person that I've met in this game. Other than that. First guy. Good night, Doc. Um, oh, I would. I'd prefer to hit the guard. I I'd prefer to hit the uh, guard. Right, hang on, hang on. Can I? Uh, let's close that for a sec. Just so he can't see. Uh, now, can I? still break this it's gonna make noise but I, 
I don't care. There's no good way of doing this. I'm not- I don't want to hit anyone. I don't want to ambush the guard, I don't want to hit Joey. And if that means I'm gonna have to get physically chased because this is loud and stupid, then so be it. Ooh, oh shit, man. Um, inspect? Okay. Go out. This is crazy, dude. Don't freak out. You'd Just... think they'd have more security on the windows. Yeah. For like a, a, a prisoner slash fugitive, fugitive person. I just slid that bitch open and just stepped out. Uh, keep going. I've, I've, I think I've clicked on everything there is to click on. And I'll close the curtain so he can't see either. So I think we're good. Oh, I can just go back inside. Okay. Right, okay. Can't look anywhere. Let's shuffle. Don't think. Just... It's... Going. It's high up, but it's not that high up. We could survive the oh, fall. Shit. Oh, calm down, dude. Calm down, calm down. Take a breath, dude. Sorry if my uh, recording lagged a little bit just before. I noticed it came, it popped up saying encoding overloaded, so uh, it should be mostly okay, but if there's any lag in these episodes, I apologize. Escape. Through to the construction room. Damn. Way too close. Imagine doing this with like one eye. Like a new situation, one eye as well. So you're not even used to it yet. Time to get my shit from the staff room. There he is, sleeping. Is, is he asleep again? Okay. Fucking hell. The guard is sleeping. This Jesus is Christ. Sleeping. Didn't he say something was in that room? Oh no, he just mentioned that the scaffolding went through to it. Yeah. If Jesus is, is getting a bit ballsy here, I would have gone much slower than that, personally. Well, I wouldn't have done any of this, personally. Is it, have we got our bag? Yes. We're ready for the road again, and we didn't hit Joey. <laughs> I wonder if he's going to be accused of helping us escape anyway, because the guard let us in. And then we escape. Um, oh, goodness me. Careful on the way down. That's... That's Finn. Is so. Oh, hello. No way. What is he doing uh, here? I don't want anything to do with Finn. Yeah, no, Finn, Finn lied to us. Finn, like, used a nine-year-old boy to steal some money from a, a safe. Finn literally is an arsehole, and he, like, betrayed everyone. Uh, I, I want nothing. And apparently, we, we learned in this episode, he lied about Sean and said we were involved. So fuck Finn completely. Let's just escape. I want nothing to do with him. Watch us make noise and wake him up anyway. I wouldn't take one of these cars. Please tell me we're not about to steal one. I would just I would run several miles away first before we consider stealing a car. Because if we steal like a think about it, if we steal a car here, they know it's us. But if we steal a car twenty miles away. Could be anyone. This is stupid thinking. <laughs> you got to think about these things when you're escaping from the law. This is just bad. So we've escaped from police custody. We are now uh, Grand Theft Autoing. 
L literal crime Grand Theft Auto. Oh, itchy nose. Does he know how to hotwire a fucking car? I take it he knows how to drive then as well. That's a revelation. Don't you don't have to rev the car that loud, man. Fucking hell. Sacred Hope Hospital. By the way, I want I want to just point out something I've realized in looking at my own recordings. It looks like my videos are slightly blurry, but I want to point out that that's not um, anything to do with my videos. It's the game. The game has lots of depth of field moments and the edges of things look blurry a lot of the time in this game. I wonder if I should change some of my settings. Um, like anti-aliasing, maybe turn it down a bit because that can be blurry. Oh, don't fucking fall asleep at the wheel, man! Fucking hell! You've got you've got one damaged eye, and you're falling asleep at the wheel. Like he's gonna fucking crash. And then we've got like destruction of property as another crime. <laughs> oh. It's a bit quiet, but is this another copyrighted song? Oh, it's not quiet anymore. I'd like to point out every single episode has had multiple copyright claims on, on YouTube. The minimum number of copyright claims on a single video I've uploaded is two, but one of the episodes had, th I want to say four copyright claims on one half of one episode. Oh, it's it's a joke. But I'm sorry, I've got to, as long as I can get away with it, I've got to use the original music. I checked out, um, I don't watch Jacksepticeye, but, um, I just, I wanted to see somebody else's Life is Strange 2 playthrough, uh, like, just to compare, do you know what I mean? Quality and so on. And he's got, uh, Jacksepticeye's Life is Strange 2 playthrough, he's got his muted, he has the thing ticked, muted, uh, copyrighted songs. So, and, and yeah, basically, the music doesn't get replaced, it just gets cut, and these scenes are silent, dead silent. And it's really weird. Episode 4, Faith. So yeah, my point is, I'm glad. I think I've done the right decision in keeping the copyrighted music in. I don't care if my videos get claimed. As long as they don't get copyright strikes, I'm good. And how can you not include the music? This is what the developers intended. It sets the mood. This is fucking loud in my ears. Welcome to Nevada. Well, hey, we clicked our fingers and we were there. Did it say where in Nevada? A certain, a specific camp? Or something. The preview of this episode showed us walking down a road that looks just like that one there. Just a, a desert sort of road. I'm guessing we were about to lose the car. <laughs> Although you would lose it, wouldn't you? Because it's going to get reported stolen. Something else Sean hasn't thought about. I would, I would get the fuck away from this car. This car is, like, uh, radioactive. One police scanner, that's it. Boom, you're caught. I've got, I'm getting my own fucking hair in my mouth here. Jesus Christ. It's a very tranquil scene. That was a nice transition. So we are just full-blown fugitives now. Like, we've actually committed crimes now. Until now, we hadn't done anything. I mean, we may have been helping to cultivate some, some weed. <laughs> but other than that, 
we we were literally not criminals until oh, now. My eyes itchy. I should probably check clean them before. Oh right, okay, I've got to got to clean the eye. Haven Point is straight ahead. Just a few more hours drive. Uh, right, okay, so that's the hospital. We've driven down this yellow road. I don't know where we are on the road, though. Uh, I'll need the light on to do the eye. Guess I'm kind of lucky I stole a smoker's car. Why are you fucking smoking, man? It's a shitty habit. Oh, come on. Did you interview everyone in that hospital? Or what? Probably. I don't like her, but what, what if she, like, turns out to be a really good person? I'll take it, because you never know when you're going to need to call the FBI, you know what I'm saying? Achievement unlocked, Lone Wolf. Oh, it's an optional collectible. <laughs> okay. Shit. It will never hold until Haven Point. Why is there two needles on that fuel gauge? Am I just stupid? What a mess. Flotus can now add Grand Theft Auto to my file. I'm saying. She seems nice. Is this Sorry, like a... Car, guys. Yeah, what a shit thing to happen. Shit. Guess I fucked up her day pretty bad. Must do list. Uh, in the morning, drop off kids, hospital checkup, 1.30 lunch with hubby, Miss Scott's x-ray blood test, pick up kids, night shift. Us, uh... Night shift. So she's right. So we haven't stopped her picking up her kids, thankfully. What's in the bag? What's in the bag? Are these cleaning supplies for the eye? Clean eye. Make it nice and sparkly. I'm getting right. mem. Careful. I'm getting uh, memories of um, cleaning Kenny's eye in The Walking Dead. You know, when Carver bashes his fucking eye in, and Clementine has to clean his eye. Oh fucking hell! Man. It's an open socket, isn't it? To Joey. Yeah. This is a mess. Oh, did he do it? I don't even know how long I should keep on using this for. I think right now he's got an open socket. Uh, you'd, oh, how do you do that then? Because you're just going to stuff, sh shove shit in the socket accidentally. Oh. Um. Right. Can we do anything else? I think that's it. Let's get some sleep. Uh, seriously, though, we need to ditch this car. I mean, is a crime, is Grand Theft Auto lessened if you, like, don't damage the car in any way? Like, don't steal anything from inside it, leave it in, in perfect condition, and then what if you even report uh, where it is? Do you see what I mean? Maybe report anonymously to the police uh, that there is a, a stolen car here, and then it gets returned to the owner. Does that lessen the crime and the penalty and shit? I, in his situation, I would personally try and minimize every if I had to commit a crime I'd minimize every single one it would show that I'm oh, trying to be shot. responsible oh yeah. shit just oh god zoning out dream sequence just don't do that when you're driving my son so uh what's the verdict on the new car uh, I know it's not a new board but it's got four hot wheels thanks for finishing it dad a perfect reward for your excellent report card. <laughs> I'm proud, Sean. Thank you. You don't even bullshit me when you need cash. I'm trying to be honest. And I'll try to be cool. No dad jokes, huh? I hope you're not too bummed out to go on a big road trip with your lovely papito, huh? <laughs> This is like that scene with Chloe and her dad in her dream sequence after he died. For the parallels. Let's let's just be kind and nice to him. Ah, oh, please. You're the coolest dad. 
How could I be bummed? Excuse me. <laughs> Where's my regular, emotionless son? <laughs> Gone. He's in the history books. Think I'm a good guy. Five days without killing each other? Hell yeah. Haven't done that since I was a kid. I wonder if this is a memory and not a flashback. So do I. Uh, sorry, I... Been too long since we went padre y hijo. A memory, not a dream. <laughs> Way too long. I love road trips. I think it is. It's a memory. Good to hear. <laughs> By the way, boy talk. What's going on with that gin, huh? <laughs> We're trying everything we can. <laughs> uh, there isn't much to talk about. Uh, well, not much to talk about. That was like pulling teeth. Well, I've got a week to find out the truth. Didn't we just text message her and that was it? Try out new stuff. I kind of miss her. Don't worry. It's over. Let's say try out new stuff. I don't even know what this means. I just want to try out new stuff. I mean, figure out what I like. What does that mean? I want. You know? Yeah, I get it. You're young, you've got time to settle down. Maybe you will. Eventually. <laughs> ah. Who's calling? Can that be Daniel? Hola. Hello. Everything okay, Lila? Lila. Oh, Daniel better not be giving you any sass. <laughs> nah. He's an angel. We went to the swing pool, and now we're making popcorn for <laughs> He's driving real slow and safe, like a grandma. Thanks for checking in. We'll buzz you when we hit the motel. Lila, you ready? Sounds good. And Sean, Jen wants you to call her <laughs> when you have time. Hey, hey, hey. Sounds like someone is still thinking about you. Yeah. And all that shit's gone. No. See, None of this matters anymore. How are you really doing? I miss home, I've changed. Hang on, I can't tell if this is a flashback, like a memory, or if this is just like a dream sequence, because now we're saying like I've changed, I, you know. Let's just say I've changed. I'm so different now. I don't even recognize myself. Because you've changed. It's like evolution. I know it hurts. <laughs> Big time. No, I think it's still a memory. I wasn't ready to change. I have total faith in you, Sean. You're a Diaz. You were born to roam and still, find your way home. Still can't believe he got killed. I love you, Dad. Wish I would have told you more. You yeah, didn't this, have to tell me. this isn't a memory at all. It's you a showed me. It's a dream sequence. Oh. Should have known. By the way, oh. hey, there we go. Up. <laughs> wake up. Huh? What? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing on our property? Huh? Sleeping on the ro Oh shit, man. Oh man, I crashed hard. Oh yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? The fuck oh is Jesus kid? Christ. Get out. Are these like farmer boys? Uh let's just say okay. Jeff? Oh fuck, man. Out. That was timed. It didn't show that it was timed. We don't fuck need off. cops to deal with assholes like you anyway. Listen, what a I dick. don't want any trouble. Too late for that, boy. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. It's the fucking middle of the desert! I just... I got lost, man. I wasn't sure where I was, so... I pulled over. I swear. I had no idea this was your property. There's a fucking sign? Didn't you see it? It was nighttime. I it's dark. I was too exhausted. I guess I missed it. He's That's just a kid, and just, he's hurt. Look, just yeah. apologize. What happened to your eye? Uh. Well, shit. Let's just move. Oh fuck! I timed again. I didn't click that. This could work. If he steals the car, this could work out really well. I just want to go. Ho oh, ho! What's this? Drugs? 
Yeah, for my eye. Oh yeah. Did you steal them? Like this car? Yes. <laughs> uh Take his back. Timed again! Come on. I didn't click on that. I was trying to make Get a decision. See what he's holding. Can I pause? I really don't like that's the worst part about this game so far. That's it's, it's the one thing I don't like. I don't dislike anything else. But all every single one of those I didn't click. Or they were all timed, but they didn't show a timer. So, like, of all three of those decisions, I was trying to weigh up my options, and it was taken from me? That really sucks. I, I really wish they would have show a timer. Just to make it clear that you... Okay, quickly make a decision. Right, I'm going to click everything fast from now on. I'm going to try and just react faster. And try not to so, think through all my options. Nothing good. Any money? Fucking toys, man. You still play with toys? Seriously? It belongs to my brother. What is this Even guy's alone. problem? Uh, take it back. I mean, I'm getting the feeling like the, these guys clearly are assholes, and I've got a feeling th this might be a situation of we need to sort of stand up for ourselves. Um, I'm gonna take it back. And this is, this is gonna like escalate things, but I do want the toy back for Daniel. Whoa, you did not. That's it, boy. Uh, Get up. Okay, I need to kick this guy's ass. Okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Let him go. He's got nothing. Hey. Hold on a sec, Mike. What the fuck, you man? Spanish, Pedro? Huh? What? Great, another racist oh, asshole. Hablas Espanol. Chad. So, Professor, how do you say, I'm a dirty thief? You're stealing from me, motherfucker! Oh, you don't want to say your language? Oh my god, that was timed again. I didn't click okay. that. Maybe you know this one. That's really fucking uh, annoying. I'm a dirty thief? With one eye. <laughs> what is this guy's fucking problem? Right, I've got to click. Go fuck your mother. Soy un ladrón y chinga tu madre. Uh, wait, madre? Uh... What did you really say, asshole? Huh? All I want to do is learn Espanol. <laughs> Might be our official language someday, right? See, si, senor? So, one more lesson. Oh my god. How do you say, this is not. One big knee to the balls. Este no es mi país. Say it like you mean it, boy. Okay, this guy needs to die. Let's go full Chad, criminal. <laughs> it's gonna rain. Let's go before we get soaked. Hold on. This what the fuck is wrong with this guy? With me. You're really pissing me off, you know that? But I'm go gonna fuck yourself. To things right. Oh, what now? Sing something. What? Just pass the audition, and you're free. He's gonna like headbutt me you while I'm singing. Set if you refuse. The, nah, no, no, no. In this situation, you d uh, there's 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 de-escalation, and then there is a guy who is clearly fucking with you, and de-escalation doesn't work. He's just this is just a man who is going to fuck with us no matter what we do. If we sing, he's fu he's fucking with us. If you know. He'll probably just hit me anyway. I'm not gonna fucking sing. No. He's gonna fuck with us no matter what. Really? He's gonna hit, probably punch us no matter okay. what. I warned you, boy. Stop! Stop it, Chad! Uh, what the fuck, man? Uh, what the actual fuck? Uh, you need to stop your friend. Uh, Holy cow! What, what the actual you fuck? Doing? Listen, you little beaner. Get your shit and go now. <laughs> At least he gave me my shit. Drive straight and you'll hit the highway. Forget this happened, man. Okay? At least he gave us our bag back or whatever the fuck that was. I would, I wouldn't, 
but just I would be so tempted to run him over. Fuck! Fuck! Oh, he's losing his shit. And can you blame him? What a dick. What an asshole. And we're out of fuel. Jesus, I'm getting all I'm fucking hot and bothered now. Yeah, we did, we're not gonna sing for that motherfucker. He was just fucking with us, so just refuse. He would he would have punched us anyway. You know what I mean? He would have, clearly. Fuck him. I'd rather stand up for myself and refuse and get hit. Brothers were split apart. The oldest wolf was badly hurt, but nothing could stop the wolf from following his brother's tracks. Let's just forget that arsehole even exists. But yay, another racist arsehole. Beena. What the fuck, man? There's a lot of stereo- I'm, I'm just thinking, there's a lot of, like, stereotypes in this game. I was called out on it for- in one of the first episodes, rightfully, um, for perpetuating a stereotype myself. But- but since then, I've- it's- it's been- all these stereotypes are fucking hitting me hard, and it's like, I can't stop seeing how obvious it is. Like, the one guy we run into in, like, Nevada is some racist <laughs> desert fucking- Twat. <laughs> oh, he's covered in sweat. He needs some water or you're gonna, like, fucking die. Takes you, what, like a week or two to die of starvation, but with no water you'll die in just a couple of fucking days. Especially walking through the hot, sunny desert. You're fucked in, like, a day okay. without water. Still a few hours away from Haven Point. Um, I, almost there. I don't want to just start wandering... <laughs> I went to the middle of nowhere, but can I, like, go back and click on some shit? Oh, we're stumbling as well. We are a stumbling. We got our toy back. I wonder if I didn't gr uh, choose to grab it. I bet we would have lost it. Okay, okay, I just wanted to... Alright, sorry. I wanted to see if we can climb up that. I'm glad we chose to get the toy back, though, because now we can give it to Daniel. In that situation, in real life, I would probably do exactly what I did. Might be some shade at the next billboard. Once it's clear that some guys are just full... Once it's clear that somebody is just a full-blown arsehole and they are just trying to fuck with you, you've got to stand up for yourself. There's no, there comes a point where de-escalation and trying to be nice and honest, etc. stops working, and that's when it's... It stops working when it becomes clear that they are just an arsehole fucking with you. This, this... Can't run for miles in this heat. Ugh. We've got a bruised eye. Oh, we're fucked. Can I, like, hitchhike? Down a long and lonesome road. Yeah, I would feel the... the, what, the what I'm describing is, is how I would act in real life. I would just be, I, I am always honest and as nice as I can be in a social situation. But if somebody is then clearly fucking with you, regardless of your niceness and honestness and kindness, and they are just an arsehole, then you've got to stand up for yourself. Even if you get fucking attacked physically. An arsehole is going to be an arsehole no matter what. I wonder what's up with Haven Point. Two pair casino, poker, blackjack, spaghetti, 22, 22 fucking miles. Yes. We're not making it 22 miles without water, man. Sit down. Oh, man. My feet are killing me. Feels like hiking in hell. Drink water. Uh, drink water before we draw, like seriously. My throat it's, feels like sand. It's the most important thing right now. Oh. Can we draw still? Yes. Before I do, though, let me look at the graphics settings. Um, they're all on maximum, of 
course. Except I'm thinking of turning anti-aliasing maybe down to see if it's a little less blurry. Um, let's, put, let's put it on low and see what happens. Oh no, that just looks even worse. No, okay. I was just wondering if we could tone down the blurriness, but it's fine. It, it is what it is. Let's draw. Never drew a desert before. I mean, talk about priorities. Hmm. It's got like limited supplies. Empty and quiet. He's got like, he's running out of water, probably no food. We're in the middle of the scorching sun. Um, there we go. Priorities, you, this is not the time to draw. <laughs> Had a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. I wonder if we're going to find Daniel in this episode. It's cool you've got to focus on different angles. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. I'm moving the mouse. This place is so empty. <laughs> At least I won't mess up perspective for once. How fucked up was that though? The guy headbutted him. <laughs> I guess that's an okay start. The guy, the dude headbutted him I in his going. one eye. Got a good picture of it. That guy was a complete Ready arsehole. I think they, I think they might have overdone it a little bit with how much of an arsehole that guy actually was. Um, because that was that 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 guy was unreasonable, <laughs> to say the least. Just look around you, dude. There must be interesting details to add up. And none of these guys are gonna I get their comeuppance. Make the whole thing funnier. Draw Oasis. Let's think positive. I could try adding details. Focus a bit more. Mm. His drawing has only gotten better. I don't know what he's talking about saying it's Man. crap. My eye always starts hurting when I focus for too long. How is this game? This game is not going to have a happy ending. I mean... Anything else I can do here? Let me just turn the camera. No. Okay. Right, we're refreshed a little bit. You know, honestly, I'm thinking of Life is Strange 1 and Before the Storm. And, the, the, like, the, the final major decision of the game was such a big decision, it makes me dread. <laughs> What the hell is gonna come in this game? There's gonna be some some big giant soul crushing fucking thing coming up. Feels like I haven't seen him in years. How? Of course I miss everything about him. What's the extent of like? His whining. Yeah, you can wait to get out on your own. Uh. Now. You... And it sucks. I'm sorry, I'm not even paying attention, Sean. There's there's a is this what Americans call? Coyotes? They don't exist in the UK. Don't worry about your feet. Hello, fellow traveler. Is that a rat? Take. Can you might dig this? Cool, another souvenir. Can we say hello to the coyote? Or jackal or whatever the fuck it is. Achievement unlocked. Amazing grace. Can we, uh, can we, can we? Is that what they do as well? I shoot, I don't, I, I have no fucking um, wildlife knowledge so at all. Fucking hot. Um, Feels like my But if that is, is a coyote, do they burrow like that under the ground? Dead animal. Shit. This place is freaking me out. Meal? Oh, it's already had a big chunk taken out of it. Let's go. I was I was wondering how like far I could walk in a given direction, or if it's going to turn me Whoa. around. Whoa! Oh, shit! Oh my goodness me! Better stick to the road. Will it actually attack me? I'm kind of. Uh, oh, let's not be it. Mm. Uh. Oh, he's fucked. No way! I'm going to die out here. Let's get back on the road. Just keep on walking. This has taken me way too long, I apologize. There's a truck coming. A fucking signal in man. Signal! Hand out! 
Whoa. Signal. Is she honking at me? Please She's tell me it's please tell me it's not like a Okay, uh be cool. Just see what he wants. Can he give us a ride? Please tell me he's not some sort of dodgy guy, you know what I'm saying? Just some picking up picking up weary fucking travelers on the road. At least he stopped. Jesus will have you. I'll say I'll save you. Trust Jesus will save you. Cops. Right. Hello. Hey, need a lift? Yes. It's too damn hot to be walking. I don't trust you, but but yes. I mean, if he turns out to be some weird fuck, we can always fight him and try and get away. It's taken us too long on the on the on the road. Sometimes in life. You've got to place your faith in another person. Yeah. Thanks. Hold up. You know what I mean? Our situation is shit and dire. We've got to, we've got to trust in a fellow man. He might just be a good guy. Nice logs, bro. I've noticed this game is a lot sort of darker than the first game, at least. At least to my vision, it's like colors are a little, little bit washed out, sort of. That's just the art style, I guess. What the hell happened to you? Got beat up by some assholes. I ran into a couple of assholes who beat me up for no reason. Uh, I see. Happens a lot around here. Is he going to do the same? Why does it happen a lot around here? Hey, Anton. You there? Everything all right? Yeah, what's up? GPS tells me you parked in the middle of nowhere. Just wanted to know what happened. I, uh... I had to make a shit stop. Over. <laughs> a shit stop? Yeah, too much information, but... 10-4. <laughs> you mean number two. You owe me a beer for that. Over and out. These guys seem nice. Let's become a trucker. Make some more money. Don't freak out. I... I wouldn't have picked you up if I cared about that hitchhiking law. Okay. What law? Cool. What's he reaching for? So... You hungry or what? You look hungry. I am hungry. Like, for real. Is this gonna make me pass out? Am I gonna wake up locked in some dungeon? I am. Faith. The episode, Faith. I've just remembered, is heard. called Faith. My name's Anton. It is good, huh? My wife packs the best sandwiches. <laughs> Messy. Best sandwich ever. He's Seriously. kind. Thanks, I sir. Hope. Anton. Anton. Right. Ooh. What's your destination? Hmm. What's the name of the park Haven again? Point. Haven Point. You heard of it? Oh yeah. Straight ahead, about an hour. Well, this isn't going to be a smooth hour. Some shit's about to go down, isn't it? Clearly. <laughs> Who's that a picture of up there? He's got a creepy face on a cactus. Can't do anything, can I? No, it's a cutscene. Take a nap if you want. Oh, God, no. You don't have to stay awake to be nice. Hey, don't worry, kid. I'm not a fucking weirdo. Um, do I go on faith again, or is this automatic? Please don't sell me to some, like, cult or, some, or something. I'd, yeah, you know, you hear stories. I'll, I'll, I'll wake up in some sort of weird sex cult camp. Like uh, Trevor uh, taking people to that cult in GTA 5. 
Oh, it's automatic. I don't have to make a choice. I've never been to America, but it would be cool to... I mean, I'm sure Americans probably think, like, what the fuck, but to a non-American, that sort of scene is pretty cool, just driving down a long desert road. Last stop. Haven Point. Thank you so much. You just be careful out here. These people are kind of weird. Kind of weird how? Really? Okay. 10-4. Oh. Is this where Jacob lived, like, came from? Because Jacob was a little weird with like some religious religious stuff. He was he was a little odd. I wonder if that's why he came here and brought Daniel with him. Apparently, so he was nice. I'm glad we got in now. He did, he was just a straight up nice guy. He fed us. He took us the entire way to our destination. What a good guy. I wonder if you refused his lift, if you would end up getting in anyway. He is risen. Happy Easter. Wow. Forgot about Easter. I think the, I uh... Lost track of time. In, in what, what you might call, or some, some would call a weird place like this. It, it just means they're strongly religious. Little village. I think the best bet is to, uh... Keep your head down... Don't tr try not to ruffle feathers. No worshipping the fucking devil, you know what I'm saying? So glad that, for sure, Claire wouldn't approve gambling. And if anyone asks, I'm just agnostic and I don't have any idea. Can't a lot of cars for a place in the middle of nowhere. Oh my god, is this going to turn out to be like, um... Well, I hope it's not an actual cult, but is it going to turn out to be like a cult of, uh... Fucking keep using that word uh, a church of like um i don't know I how you was trying to tell me something about this please yeah I i'm getting either cold like straight up cult or it is just a church but they're quite uh strong how would you describe it leave. fuck's sake okay I've gotta find daniel just, i don't know how you would describe them just a a, a a church of very strong passionate believers Oh shit. Hope those people are caring Christians. Like our grandparents. Like, I know there's a couple of famous churches in America that are like very strong and, you know. I can't think of the names of. But not, nor do I want to. Is she sick? You okay now? Is it gone? I. I think. Do they refuse yeah. medical attention because of the religion? Inside now. Okay, Dad. It's amazing how the brain just jumps to conclusions. Uh, hello there. He's dressed like a religious right? person. Yeah, yeah. Uh, don't worry. You here for the service? No. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna be honest. Uh, not really. Looking for someone. Don't be shy. Everybody's welcome here. Thank you. No matter who you are or where you're from. In his eyes, we are all equal. Plus, okay. we have a pretty nice spread after the service. Stay as long as you want. Okay. That's very kind. Thanks. Just be nice. <laughs> just thank me. Just be courteous. Just a vessel for our reverend. Thank her. Okay, I will do. <laughs> Looks like you're here to see our new miracle, right? Uh, what miracle? Uh, what miracle? <laughs> you haven't heard of him? No, Did sir. I spoil it for you. Oh god. Be here any minute now. Do they think Jesus has risen? For yourself. Can I explore first? Praise the Lord. Praise Lord. That poor little girl. Uh, yeah. Cost uh, sounds real bad. I'm guessing they don't like Father hospitals and medicine and shit. Maybe people won't judge me here. When we talk about another stereotype, it's like strong, I, I don't know the way to describe it, but I'm just saying strong church. Uh, don't agree with medical opinions. That's kind of another stereotype right there. Not much different than my hipster stickers. People Let go. showcase what they love. Let God. License plate, ATN. Wow. Utah. Must be a pretty good church to drive all this way. So I'm guessing there's some like, um, 
prophet or they think like Jesus has come back or something. Um, what's my objective? Enter the church, right? Okay. Hey, I've got my getaway vehicle right there. Let me just go snooping around. At least they're friendly. My eye is itchy again. Even if you don't, uh, it, though. even if you don't agree with, you know, uh, a specific slice of religion, doesn't mean you can't be kind and courteous and listen to what they have to say, even if you know you will never agree with them. You can, you can still be nice. The problem is when they go crazy on you. <laughs> Wonder how many people come and go through this place. All right, what's in this outbuilding? Smells like bacon and bread in there. Oh, oh shit, I'm starving. I am actually starving for real. I haven't eaten. Is it going to turn me around down here? It's going to force me back. No? Oh, Jesus, this is a big area. Nevada is like a giant slot machine. But this place seems different. Houses. What are they doing around here? A and B. Except going to church. They're either like growing some drugs or these are like innocent, actual, like, I don't know, dormitories or schools or some shit. Maybe this is like a live on campus type deal. Feels I'm trying to avoid the, uh. Out of time. I'm trying to avoid the word cult. Quiet. But obviously the game, obviously. It, the game is is leading you to that assumption. Maybe I can ask a bit more about this place. Are they all in the church? I'm guessing. I'm gonna. Uh, I mean, that trucker did say they were weird. I, he could just be, um, you know. I wonder what kind of community this is. Did Jacob really live here all his life? He might just be being a little mean. So Jacob is from here, then. Makes sense. Weird. Looks like our old train. I, I can't remember much about Jacob, other than he came from, like, a sort of a religious place. I can't remember any details. Okay. Where are so, we? So the game has let me wander around. Um... But there's like almost nothing to click on. I'm not going to go in the back door either. The, 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 the last thing you want to do is like piss off a bunch of religious people. I can't uh, see anything. You know what I mean? It's time to go to church. They very kindly let me, you know, welcomed me. Must be more kids here. Huh. Wonder if Daniel... I'm just, I'm just going to try and pretend I am literally Sean. All the decisions I'm going to make are as if I was in this position. I'm going to be honest, I'm going to be courteous, um, but I will question things if I need to. So, yeah, very humble. Called and chosen. Let's do it. You don't sneak in the back door, do you know what I mean? That's, 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 that's just weird. Oh... Feel that cold. Why are you talking about my brother like that? Oh, thank what? God for AC. Oh my God, it's just hit me in one go. Is Daniel here, and they think he's like Christ reborn because of his special powers? Is that what's going on here? Praise be to Daniel, your friends, the Blatties. We saw a miracle child of Jesus to get uh, today in Reverend Fisher Church. Thank you. I would not believe it unless I saw it with my very own eyes. Daniel is neither. <sighs> Is indeed an angel sent down unto us. Hallelujah. Fake. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for the angel Daniel. He has arrived to clean the filth and sinners from the world. Oh, my God. So, Daniel, I mean, out of nowhere, I wasn't expecting Daniel to be here at... I can feel it. Let's just try and ignore the rhetoric. What's going on? All you can eat barbecue. New disciple Daniel for... Oh, fuck me. Please tell me he's not, like, brainwashed. 
It would be if you're a nine-year-old boy and you've got special powers. It would be remarkably easy to brainwash you and, th and make you think you're like the prophet or some shit. Claire had pretty much the same ones. Huh. Oh, I don't like the direction this is going. Take one. Claire had pretty much Oops. Ones. Huh. Hey, it's for charity. I do not like this. I want to be nice and courteous and shit, but I'm not going to... I'm not going to shy away from telling Daniel this is all a bunch of shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, can I make a donation? Uh, Wonder how donations can pay for all of this. How much money have I got? $17. I'm not going to, because I will need that to buy food and drink and shit. And honestly, in my position, Sean needs it. We need to buy water. You know what I mean? Um... I wonder if that would actually help me, though, donating. If Clarence... Can I get some water? Can I refill? Better clean up first, so I don't scare Daniel. Oh, so Daniel is here. Please tell me it's not so weird that they're going to, like, try to sacrifice him or some shit. Please tell me the game is not going to go that far. That's... Better than nothing, I guess. Anything else? Anything else? No, okay. At least we cleaned up. Shall I make a donation? If it's like one dollar, I don't... You know, in fact, let's do it. Hopefully it's just like one dollar or some shit. Okay, fine. Uh, make me feel guilty. Seventeen, nineteen. One dollar. That's, that, that's what I was hoping for. Cool. Um, can I go upstairs? I don't want to interrupt like a sermon. Oh, look at us going full sneak mode. Hear that word a lot, but faith is not just a word. My oh Jesus! Oh no! What is faith? Remember Luke 18, 27. What is impossible for man is possible for God. Amen. With that righteous faith comes the salvation of your souls. Can you cross that invisible bridge to salvation? I don't like this. <laughs> Do you want your soul to be saved? I don't want to be mean and sisters. Yes. or offensive. Yes. But Oh, yes. Come on, dude. You are not like all these sinners out there. Have we seen her before? Asked the Lord for a sign. Then he gave me one. Where is Daniel anyway? Spoke to me and told me that I was doing right. And to reward our great faith, the Lord sent me the ultimate gift. I disagree. I think that's the best way of saying it. I disagree. Graced with the power of God. The Maybe. miracle we have all been praying for. We don't know. Waiting for. We don't know where Daniel's power came from. A hallelujah. hallelujah. Do you have faith in his power? Yes. Do you have faith in me? No. Then please welcome our newest member. People are people. Our latest miracle, the angel Daniel. Praise you, Daniel. Oh, Jesus Christ. They've just made him dress nice. It's, it's all good. I wonder on what level he's been brainwashed. Daniel, the prophet who was thrown to the lions by false prophets. But God saved Daniel so he could do his work. Yes, Daniel was brought to me to deliver us, to guide us from the wilderness to our destiny. This is fucked. Now Daniel will reveal the true <laughs> oh power of the Lord. The power of the Lord. This is fucked. 